I did most of the trainings from Mind Magics. Yes, I for Musa also I have done training from Mind Magics. Hello everyone, this is Neelima from Mind Magics, and uh, I welcome you to yet another review video of Mr. Shubra. He's enrolled with us for MuleSoft training, and uh, let's catch up with him and evaluate how he finds the, his training experience with Mind Magics. Hi, Shubra, how are you doing? Hi, uh, it's not, hello, ma'am. I'm uh, doing good. Thank you. How are you? I'm doing good as well, uh, Shubra. Thanks for asking, though. Uh, so, Shubra, let us know first about your professional experience. Uh, actually, ma'am, I'm a software professional and uh, having 15 years of experience and uh, working in a France-based MNC. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, currently, I'm also pursuing MBA uh, because I would like to go into the management field. Mm -hmm. uh, so, uh, the thing is that, in, as you know, like in software career, a particular technology is not consistent and you have to keep learning day by day. It mm -hmm. may be uh, an initiation from you or it might be from the company. So, so that, that that's the main reason actually why I came for Salesforce and actually I would like to build my career in Salesforce because technologies can keep deprecating and uh, with time and so we have to keep our learning curve always going up and uh, that, that's the main reason. Uh, that's all about me like uh, what I'm currently doing. Have you got yourself trained even on Moonsoft? I got for Salesforce, Mulesoft, every, I did most of the trainings from MindMagics, yes. I for Mulesoft also, I have done training from MindMagics. So Mr. Shubra, uh, can you please tell me uh, what all trainings you've taken with MindMagics? Sure, ma'am. Actually, uh, initially when I came to MindMagics, I think I came on 2021. Uh, that's the first time I came into in touch with MindMagics. And uh, I actually I did not knew MindMagics initially. So uh, MindMagics came with some net, net surfing only. Mm -hmm. So I was given a target to complete Salesforce certification by my company mm -hmm. and uh, so I came for Salesforce retail in the very beginning and when I came to MindMagics after this online surfing, so they promised that okay, they will give me the training in administrator. The very first thing that I came for the thing is administrator. So my also another requirement was to get a create a certification because that was a, uh, that was like something like a requirement given from the company. So I think I joined in 2000, uh, June or July something like that in 2021 in MindMagics. Mm -hmm. And uh, the training went and I think after one or two months, uh, I think I cleared the certification for administration. Mm -hmm. And since then, I took uh, four certifications still now. All the courses were from MindMagics. So the first one was an administration uh, for Salesforce. Second one was for the platform developer one. Uh, mm -hmm. And two, I have not appeared. Two, I, I am yet to appear. The third one, I went for uh, Aura training and that was for app developer, uh, Lightning app builder. Mm -hmm. And recently, one month back that I uh, took was for MuleSoft, that was also for a requirement from the company to create a MuleSoft certification. And I came to MindMagics, I think on April 4th, something like that. And after like one or two months preparation and after the training, I cleared MuleSoft also. All right. So you said you've mentioned a list of uh, different trainings that you've taken through MindMagics. Any yep. particular reason why you keep coming back to MindMagics? So Actually, ma'am, uh, the thing is that um, uh, behind the scene, uh, I saw my first certification getting cleared and I got a confidence, okay, if I, because the thing is that, see, clearing a certification depends on two things. First and foremost thing is that how sincere you are with the uh, course and uh, second thing is that how is the trainer. So the trainer actually did this part very nicely. I will say very nicely because uh, in mind basics, I saw one unique thing. Mm -hmm. The unique thing is that the trainers are a bit strict, strict in the sense of completing our assignments. They will give regular assignments every day. And uh, they will also make sure our assignments are complete, whether I'm a, I'm, uh, I'm a uh, lone person in the team or I work because I have, uh, I think one or two course I took, I, I took alone uh, with MindMagics. And uh, for, and, and there are, and there's just, uh, for my, for MuleSoft, we had a very huge team. Mm -hmm. But in both the cases, what I saw is that the trainer made sure that each and every person completes the assignment. So okay. that follow-up is done very strictly. And uh, that is one good thing that I saw. And uh, that is actually that help, help the people to learn more. The good thing is that. Mm -hmm. And second thing is that like uh, if you regularly do the assignments, if you regularly go to the videos, because the videos will be shared by end of the day. Whatever live sessions we had, the videos will be shared by end of the day. If you go to the practice sessions one by one by doing the exercises and then we go to the assignments that we do, I think most of the concepts get cleared. And I think in 90% it will be okay to appear for certification after a little bit of study from there. Because the, the trainer will guarantee you that if you go to whatever I have given, if you do it one or two times, he will also give some practice uh, examples. 
and he will tell that if, if you complete all these things your certification will be definitely will get it and actually i am the uh, uh, proof actually because i have done that way and i got it shubhra could you please let us know or enlighten us that uh, the trainings that you've undergone with mind magics have they helped you professionally yes definitely professionally they help me because uh, in one way i uh, in my own project only we are using a particular section so uh, where actually sales force retail plays a very important role i will not say mule saw because mule saw is yet to come to my scope in our company uh, uh, but in sales force actually definitely yes because uh, i was able to, i think we are not i was not able to understand initially in one way uh, that those things have become very clear actually uh, those concepts i was able to correlate the main thing is that of what i studied with what existed in the project so i was able to correlate and uh, yeah it was very helpful man and uh, possibly within the next couple of days we i might also get a chance to work in my, uh, in mulesoft and that also will play a very important role in my career that's for sure how practically intensive is the training with the, the uh, content that you are getting trained in? is it good enough to give you good foundation for the course it's good enough it's good enough because each and every topic will be cleared more than that one more thing that i would like to focus here is see the assignments he will do on a regular basis but after the assignments he will also get a project so uh, where actually you will get a real time experience on exactly how it looks like or it may look like in your real time environment so from your soft only i will tell you uh, the recently what i have done we got we did all the assignments and after that we got the in the last actually the trainer gave us a project on banking application mm -hmm. so we had to do that in one or two things that he showed us the remaining things uh, actually we had to do it so yes it was helpful and uh, see this is very important why important is see you will learn the things in bits and pieces uh, as a part of the training but how to put everything together in one application that actually matters and that is how it's the real industry works okay. so if you get that experience right is very good so uh, how would you rate your uh, learning in terms of uh, job opportunities would you like to confirm that people who get trained with the content offered by mind magics they would definitely be confident to apply for uh, interviews and get themselves a job definitely ma'am definitely why because see uh, the, everything is concept wise only and uh, mind magics makes sure that all the topics are covered so in interview questions yeah it can you see to be very frank and honest in the first one or two interview you, you may be like confused okay like they ask some questions which are unrelated but if you keep giving the interviews one or two times uh, definitely you can you, you, you can succeed because even i got offers it's not like i didn't got i got offers uh but so that, that that's what i'm saying like uh if you go to the contents right if you know what actually mind magic taught you or uh, which courses uh, that the concept that i covered actually that is uh, sufficient enough to crack the interviews but yeah for interviews some little bit of extra preparation are definitely needed i will not say it is not needed or that contents only only sufficient but yes the base should be clear and that is actually done and one more thing i would like to add here when actually i went for mules of training mules of actually was not only for the technical guys it was for technical non and non technical both and i can see both the teams actually progress in a very good way i can see even non technical people responded very good to the training it was very good to the assignments that was given so we had a team of something around 10 to 15 people i as far as i remember and uh, it consists of both technical and non technical and the very first day only the trainer actually uh, his name is sujit and uh, i would like to name his name because actually he was a very nice guy so uh, he to like he told that he actually promised everyone that once you do it your uh, if you go to the contents what i gave you it will definitely be able to clear certification and in my batch only like within one month has been 3 to 4 people already cleared certification as far as i know so as far as i was in touch with them yep so in how many attempts uh, did you all clear the certification i i cleared in first attempt only and one more guy cleared as, as far as i know cleared in one uh, in first attempt only other two persons they cleared i know but i think about i'm not sure how many attempts they did but we, we get two free attempts Mm -hmm. so i i hope they also cleared with the first attempt only uh, because uh, because they did not came back saying that okay we did not do well now what to do those kind of questions never came in the group which actually we created for our study purpose are there any topics during your training that you found difficult to understand and you wanted a re explanation or a in depth explanation of that particular topic so how was that experience we found issues in many things that because uh, technology was new to grasp it at one shot was very difficult uh, assignments to be complete see whenever we did the assignments we definitely got errors even if we did sort of video second time also the live session that happened in the morning 
yeah my mail used to upload it in the uh, after just one hour two or two hours and then in the night whenever we were free like we used to go to the videos and then we complete the assignments we got many issues we got issues i mean i will not uh, be telling different thing i we got issues but to be very frank uh, in the very next day again when we come to the sessions right we used to like uh, uh, our trainer used to give take give us screen control and we used to show our, our like the issues that we got and those issues will be like uh, cleared at that time only like whatever errors we got or whatever we are the state where we got blocked so he used to tell us okay this is the place where we have done some mistake and this is why it's not going so that actually helped us it helped us because we knew that okay this kind of things does not go in a correct way so i have to correct it i uh, this is the place where i that correction was needed and i made the error so those kind of things the trainer is to clear us so yes in that way it was uh, quite good it was good the trainer was very nice yes. so um after all this uh I find that you're very comfortable getting trained with the uh, mind magics. Would you like to refer your friends and peers to get trained with mind magics? Definitely, ma'am. Actually, I have referred uh, many people now by sharing the demo videos and all these things, whatever you gave. So uh, I got from mind magic. So I, 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 I showed them also. Like they were like they were quite good and they were happy also. And uh, right now, actually, the live example is that even ma'am, I am currently still pursuing LWC. Uh, this is an ongoing training which I have. After Milsop, this is just another training for mm -hmm. LWC. So yes, so that also I am currently it is ongoing and this uh, possibly in the coming two to three weeks also it will get completed. So yes, uh, I have ref I have referred many people um, and uh, they are quite impressed actually uh, with just uh, these trainings. It's okay. like very, it's a very broad and uh, so yes definitely because I myself has come for so many times. I think it's the fifth time I have enrolled for another course for LWC. So mm -hmm. yes definitely it's good. So um, would you like to comment on the fee structure of the uh, training? Do you find the training expensive or you find it aptly priced? Man, actually, uh, the thing is that see, uh, we, uh, the fees is more of it is less. That is actually again de dependent when you are comparing with the uh, with the different institutes. But for me, it never happened. Why it never happened? Because I never went out of mind magic to search another institute. That's a, that's one case. So that part actually I never saw only. I never compared only because I never got a Samsung. Because I found the training was good. So whatever the fees they told actually I paid. Because for me the training method the most, uh, the most. So uh, because anyway that I can anyway recover if I get a uh, good uh, job or something that I can recover the amount. So that's that's not a big deal for me. Mm -hmm. So but uh, yes, having said that, it's more or less that it's only possible to tell when you are comparing that institute with another institute. Mm -hmm. But I never moved out of mind, just to be very frank. So I never I never knew this thing, but I just more or less. I still want to go ahead and ask you if there are any suggestions that we have to work on to improvise our service to us learners. Uh, improvement side actually because uh, I uh, because the timing and everything also like whenever we had some issue it was like well organized only. Mm -hmm. uh, some improvements actually is not coming to my mind because everything I was doing in a correct way only so going in a correct way. So even if I have some concerns also like that is to get solved by mind magics. For example, like I had an issue with the timing. It used to happen in the very early morning. So so the, so I had to like, I have many different things to be done at that, that time because I have to drop my wife to office and all these things. So those kind of things actually was a hurdle for me uh, to manage both this training and this one. But again, uh, this timing and everything also that my managers managed it somehow. Uh, like they gave me flexible timings. Mm -hmm. So those things. So uh, I don't think any improvement I can say at this point because I got everything corrected the way I want. So I don't think anything is needed as of now. How about the rating that you would like to give to our support team, the Mind Magic? Mm, yeah, support team. Yes, definitely ten out of ten, or whatever, whatever is the higher percentage you have, you give me, or this one grade you give me. I'll give the max of it because uh, support team is quite proactive. I will say proactive in the sense like whenever in uh, in terms of the fee structure or in terms of the how we are paying the fees, uh, whether we are able to pay it in time or not, or they will give some more time. So those kind of things are very supportive. On top of that, they should like inform us that, okay, that uh, if there is a the trainer is not coming, that they will inform us well ahead of time so that we can plan the schedule accordingly. And also like uh, if we have some concerns with the training, then we can also approach them and we can ask them and the response also is very fast. So that way, yes, ma'am, the support team is quite good, I will say. I got a good support from uh, MindMagics. That's very nice to hear that you've given good feedback to Mind Magics, and uh, that's we nice, that's nice. Uh, also appreciate the fact that you are liking getting trained with Mind Magics, and you are really content with the training being offered through us. Thank you so much, and have a great day. Thank you, ma'am.